Good morning, everyone. Oh, it's so nice to see you seated sort of close together. It's kind of cool. You kind of clump together like, uh, I don't know, lemmings or something. Hopefully you're not going to go off a cliff or anything. So, But, oh, oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. Um, anyway, sorry. The niceness of the whole thing distracted me. <laughs> Welcome to Athens Christian Reformed Church. It is so, so, so very good to be here with you in person. It is also so, so very good to be able to be with you if you are online and uh, watching this service a week from now. You are no less part of our community than anyone who is here in person. And if you ever uh, get the chance to come and visit us here or be here, or if you feel eventually confident and comfortable enough to come, uh, we will welcome you with uh, appropriately and comfortably open arms whether you need that to be metaphorical or whether you need that to be literal, we are here. Um, for announcements this morning, uh, there are a couple of things that I wanted to highlight for you. One is uh, I wanted to thank you for all of your prayers for classes. Our classes meeting was just this past uh, Friday and Saturday, yesterday and the day before. It went well. Uh, it was, uh, you know, we had... Uh, as always at, at classes, you have things that are challenging either because uh, they're out of your uh, field of expertise, like for me, the finances, or <laughs> but then you also have things that are just uh, wonderful and interesting uh, to talk about. We will talk a little bit later about a couple of prayer requests that came out of our classes meeting, or at least I became aware of because of that, uh, but that'll come up during pastor uh, car congregational prayer. Also, I wanted to highlight for you, we are still looking for nominations for elder and deacon. We are grateful we have received uh, nominations for uh, both of those positions thus far. The ideal is to have at least twice the number of nominees as you uh, have positions to fill. So uh, we would like to see a couple more uh, nominees still. So please be considering prayerfully uh, whether or not God is calling you to uh, stand for that or whether God may be calling someone you know for that. Also, uh, we wanted to highlight for you that for the first time in uh, two years, I guess maybe almost three years, uh, we will be having, Lord willing, an Easter choir. The uh, details about that and who to contact are in your bulletin, which you should have received via email, but that's just exciting. Uh, last but not least, in terms of announcements, wanted to highlight for you that we have been invited to be part of a denominational survey you received in your email uh, a while ago, a, uh, a link to be part of that. It is not just a small thing that's unimportant. It gives the denomination understanding about who makes up our denomination and allows them to uh, target ministries to uh, the congregations that we have in our denomination. So please consider taking it. Um, it is not horribly long. It does take a little bit of time. Um, so please be aware of that and consider that uh, in the next couple of weeks or so. Now, would you please rise and receive God's greeting. <clears throat> Welcome, brothers and sisters, into this place. Whether you are here with us in person or online, welcome. In the name of our loving and gracious God, who poured out his life for us, welcome. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Amen. Let us begin our musical worship by singing together, Come Thou Fount, number 561 in Lift Up Your Hearts, but also on the screen as well. Come Thou Fount of Every Blessing. 